Nigerian youth have been urged to maximize their potential by prioritizing education to reduce rate of unemployment in the country. Youth in Uyo, the Alpaipam state capital, made the call while commemorating 2024 International Youth Day with the theme Digital Pathways to a Sustainable Future as the theme. Our correspondent David Isong completes this report. Youths, often described as the leaders of tomorrow, are globally celebrated on the 12th of August every year. On this day, youth issues are brought to the front burner of discussion while the potential of youths as partners in today's global society is recognized. According to the National Bureau of Statistics, the current rate of unemployed youths stand at 8.60%, a 1.4% decline from the second quarter of 2023, which stood at 7.20%. Experts have harped on the need to harness the digital age for youth growth and inclusivity. For Mr. Rogos Power, he believes that education is the foundation every youth must engage in. Many people are not educated enough. Many youths are not enlightened enough. That is why we are out there pushing this. We need people to understand that we are in an era where you can easily do what you want to do on the technology. See, the digital, um, the digital realm right now we are seeing ourselves is just a peak, just a peak of what is, what is to come. No. Speaking on the theme, Youth Digital Pathway for Sustainable Development, Mr. Gospower advised youths to embrace and take advantage of technological advancements to better their lives. Understand this technology, how does it work? Try and see the guideline, try and see the track from where it was before. Once you are able to embrace this particular stuff, it is, it, it, it is lucid, it's very lucid. Getting roles, getting employed in the Web3 space is very lucid. But we have seen technology improve education. We have seen technology improve healthcare. Right now, especially on the blockchain field, you can practically book for an appointment. Yes, it's not everything you can do in the medical field, right? You can't do everything online but to an extent you can get consultations from professionals and you don't need to have the expenses of traveling out to know what is wrong you can on his part mr okbono isiwang urged youths to desist from illegal activities that can endanger their growth while calling on the government to carry the younger generation along in certain policy decisions if most of the youths believe uh, they see the task as a very tedious task that's the truth. They see it as a, as a low income kind of a thing. But the truth of the matter is that to whom much is given, much is expected. So if you're leading people, you have to be devoted to leading these people. It would be recalled that the United Nations Assembly declared August 12th in 1999 as International Youth Day to foster youth participation, development, and peace. David Isong, ADBN News.